both Miles and I bought it 15 years ago. When we got our hands on it, it was very much a project in the making. And over the 15 years that we've had it, we've renovated it two or three times, we've added to it, and we now have a very, very good, strong local business. We have a downstairs bar area, which can seat approximately 150 people. And then we have developed upstairs into a private dining room. My passion for food comes from the fact that my mother, in the early 60s, opened up a B&B in Rossbeg on her own farm at home. And she cooked everything from, from fresh. And we killed our own cattle, we made our own butter, we made our own jams, everything local produce grew our own veg and the whole lot of that. Everything was fresh at home. So I'm, I grew up in an atmosphere of great food. My mother's table was absolutely famous. From then, I went to culinary college, went on to travel the world, Australia, America, France, everywhere, and extended my passion for food. We're in the Michelin Guide. We're in John and Sally McKenna's Bridgestone Guide, we're in Georgina Campbell's Guide, and we also know a member of Good Food Ireland. These are very important because this signifies to people the level of food that we do, the standard that we have reached, and it's also an achievement that I always want to reach. People can expect a warm and friendly welcome, beautiful atmosphere when, when they arrive in, good service, quality of food to match it, cooked with passion, served with passion. The Irish pub to us means a meeting place not just for locals but also for tourists. It is the connection um, within a village and within a community and so I think you cannot take away how special an Irish pub is within the framework of the Irish hospitality business.